All right, everybody. I just found a reason uh, for wearing a mask in this store behind me. Somebody come by me a while ago, and I had the mask, you know, the little fake bandana mask here I got to wear. I got it's right around here, you know. Gag me out. I couldn't even fucking breathe. So I found a purpose for real for having a mask on because people need to take a motherfucking bath. But uh, anyway, we'll discuss that situation. I got to load up. Hope everybody's doing all right today. Nobody worried about uh, this or that and the other. As far as uh, the riots and all that crap going on in Minnesota, I ain't worried about it. It ain't going to go nowhere. Hopefully those people realize they're fucking stupid for doing it, number one. Number two, it's fucking fake. That black guy did not die. It's all staged. It's all media. I don't know when Americans are going to figure it out that if anything's put out there for the mainstream media to see, it's fake. Everything. Not just one or two things. All of it's fake. Fake, 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 fake. I can't say it enough. Fake as fuck. F A F. Here come a Chinaman. Oh, ding dong. Oh, ding dong. Surprise the Chinaman's come out of their house. Surprise they ain't scared. Scared? Oh no. Oh no. They're going to get us. Fear pushers, fear pushers. That's all they do is push fear, push fear, push fear. Never fear, fear is here. When in reality, nothing is going on, nothing is happening. If you step outside and look around, you better be worried about Mother Nature getting your ass versus a fucking back nut virus or some shit. Alright, I think I had one of them. I got six of them. Six of them. I need five of them. Let's hope people will stand up for their damn rights. Stop wearing these gay ass masks that don't fucking help nothing. When I say nothing, I mean nothing. Don't help a thing. Hope my feather bear is doing good today. Oh, I think I got that shit took care of there. 18, 11, 10, 14, 20. But yeah, that smell, man, it fucking hit me. I was like, whoop. Pull up the old mask and try to help block out the fucking stank. Because it was stinking. Bitch ain't had a bath in two weeks. Probably since 311 when all this bullshit started. Bitch ain't took a bath. I mean stank. Stink, a lot of stink. A lot, a lot of stink. 
Like a bitch had crust coming off of her. She stunk so bad. It's bad, man. Very, very bad. Come on, printer. Print your shit. Anyway, other than the stinking lady in there, everything's pretty good here in old KY, Tucky. Probably going to rain again today. Looks like it's coming. Oh, yeah. When I first get here, I pulled up right here, you see. And there was some asshole that pulled in right as I got here. He was right here where my trailer was at. And I pulled up past him and started backing up. Well, he could tell I was backing up, and he just sat right here, right where my trailer's at, didn't fucking move, nothing. Just sat there. And I kept inching back, inching back, didn't move. And he had all this room to pull up. Wouldn't do it. So finally, I didn't know how close I was. I got within like this fucking much of hitting him. I didn't even know it. He was honking his horn at me and everything. <laughs> so I get out, stop it, and I come back here and open up my door. I couldn't even open up my back door to my trailer. Well, the motherfucker, I said, hey, man, you don't care to move up some, do you? You got plenty of room. I said, I just need to lower down my tailgate here so I can get some product out. He says, what's your fucking problem, buddy? Don't you know how to drive? I was like, yeah, I know how to drive. I said, I'm, what the hell are you doing? I said, I'm going to take some product in this store. He was just an old fucking dude, had a big white beard down to here and a little bitty fucking bitch car, a little bitty tiny car. He said, well, I'm waiting on a parking place to open up. I said, well, I don't care about that, but could you move up a little bit so I can get my tailgate down? He said something else, and I said, huh? Oh, he said, uh, he said, you look like you're hauling horses in there. I'm like, I just shook my fucking head and walked away. <laughs> he finally pulled up a little bit, and I let my tailgate down. But, yeah, that fired me up pretty good right there. I was pretty pissed off for a little bit. Old cocksucker. I mean, he didn't have to be a dick. He had plenty of room here to pull up, even where it says no fucking parking. Fucking prick. Prick of the year goes to that guy. Somebody parked in front of my truck right now. These fucking people don't know how to park at all. Got a whole fucking parking lot out here, and everybody wants to park right up on top of me. August the 4th. Is that really August the 4th? Sure as fuck it is. Said July 14th. You know what those? I need 12. Uh,
money, folks. Well, I'm going back in again. Wish me luck. That was a good little 10 minute video. Huh, I wonder if I should keep it rolling just to spy on people. Might do it. Just might do it. Man. 11 minutes is good. Peace!